Prince Harry didn't get to see George, Charlotte and Louis while back for Philip funeral. Prince Harry did not see his nephews and nieces while back in the UK for Prince Philip's funeral. The Duke of Edinburgh, who died on April 9, had his funeral service on April 17. Harry returned to the UK for the first time since he and Meghan Markle left the country after stepping down from their royal duties last year, but reports claim he did not see Prince George. Princess Charlotte or Prince Louis while back in the UK. Other than attending Philip's service at St George's Chapel at Windsor Castle, Harry hardly left Frogmore Cottage according to reports. The Duke of Sussex also visited Queen Elizabeth II while in the UK, but did not visit Prince William or Catherine, the Duchess of Cambridge. A royal source told Us Weekly, Harry didn't get to see Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis in the UK. Aside from the day of Philip's funeral and meeting privately with the Queen, he was in isolation at Frogmore. William and Kate's three children did not attend Philip's funeral service. Upon arriving in the UK from the US on April 11, Harry had to undergo a period of isolation due to strict coronavirus regulations. He was able to attend the funeral due to test to release rules and guidelines allowing people to attend funerals regardless if they are self-isolating. The Duke then went back into self-isolation at Frogmore after Philip's service before returning to the U.S. It comes as reports suggested attending Philip's funeral broke the ice between Harry and the Queen. A source told Harper's Bazaar the Duke spoke privately with Her Majesty twice, but did not discuss the Oprah Winfrey interview at length. They said, this trip was to honor the life of his grandfather and support his grandmother and relatives. It was very much a family-focused period of time. Saturday broke the ice for future conversations but outstanding issues have not been addressed at any great length. The family simply put their issues to one side to focus on what mattered. Relations between William and Harry are also off to a good start after the brothers were spotted talking after Philip's funeral. But a family friend claimed it may take time for the pair to mend their relationship after reports of a row following Megxit. They said to Vanity Fair, I think it's a good start and it was lovely to see, but this whole argument runs so deep. I don't think there is any quick fix. Knowing family, it can mend a bit and then can slip back a bit.